ready? Yeah. Sasha here from networknews.com. Uh, we are at the CS 2010 in Las Vegas still. I think it's uh, two more days to go or three more days to go for us. Uh, finally, I'm able to uh, do a little video with the Lenovo Skylight. So the first smart book from uh, a global player on the computer market. And uh, what you see over here is a 10-inch system, right? And uh, it runs on the, so it's based on the Qualcomm Snapdragon platform. It means it's a one gigahertz CPU, uh, it's integrated Wi-Fi, integrated 3G, and uh, actually the system sports a um, battery life of uh, 10 hours while right? you connected all the 3G. So what I love about this device is first of all, I mean, look how slim and thin it is. I mean, this is just amazing how they squeezed in the battery in there. And uh, when I'm taking a look at the keyboard there, because this would be my, was my first question, if a device is so thin, how is the feedback from the keyboard? And actually, I tell you one thing, this is, this is the best keyboard I've ever, ever had on any netbook or smart book or whatever so far, uh, so far in, in, in this form factor so even my even my NC10 is not competing uh, with this keyboard so really really cool feedback and um, you can see this huge trackpad with the integrated mouse buttons and, and let's take a quick look oh before we take a look around the system and all its connectors you know a little gadget on, over here so they have an integrated USB stick I kind of like this. It's, it's, it's a simple and uh, funny idea. Um, um, but you also notice um, they're using a new Linux, let's say a customized Linux uh, from Lenovo, um, and it, it, it tells you what, what smart books are all about. Because it's all about connectivity, all about being online, uh, having access to your social networks, and have your content stream on one side. So I really like the GUI that uh, Lenovo is providing with the, with the Skylight. So let's take a look around the system. Finally, we have the USB 2.0. That's a 4-in-1 card reader here. Um, is this an express card? No, I'm kind of... Ooh, I don't want to kill it now. Whatever is in there. Well, what could it be? Nicole, you know that? I can't I, see. What is it? Any kind of whatever connector? <laughs> <laughs> um, pretty much anything. Nothing on the front, and there's another USB 2.0. And I can't tell you where you can connect your 3G. You can't, uh, there's no exchangeable oh, battery. It's in here. Where the is it? 3G connectors with the. Uh, oh, really? The is, it, is it hidden over there? Yeah, oh, yeah, totally. There we go. There so you can is. get your uh, 3G <laughs> SIM card in there. Yeah, and that's a pretty much. Um, so thin. It is thin. It is super light. It is a very, very appealing device. The build quality is is really amazing. Uh, um, uh, talking about the design, I think it's all about if you you love it or you hate it. But right? I really love it.